Hello everyone, and today we're going to be drawing one of my Wolfie's Adventures characters. So today we're going to be drawing Mia, and I will be giving tutorials on drawing. But all you need to do to draw her, so, um, you have to go to sketchpad.app. And then it will take you to a digital marker space where you can draw whatever you want and it will automatically save all of your drawings. So today, I'm going to show you how to draw Nia. So today we're going to be using the paintbrush. First we need the paintbrush. We need the outline color to black. Black. Okay. Make sure there's no blur. And just gonna draw a circle. Oh, that's crooked. Uh, you get what I mean, a circle. There, that's good. Now what we're going to do is draw two large ears. Actually, no, 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 no. Sorry, sorry. There's a, a do button right there. We're just gonna do the technique for the neatest face. We're gonna do the lines here and like a long two lines right there now we have our head and body base what we're gonna need to do is draw eyes like these as you can see there is the lines in the middle of the eyes and same thing with your nose, but you want to do it like under your eyes. And one, two. There. Now we have our body base. We're going to take the paintbrush, have our line with a little thicker, and we want to use it to white, white, and just like brush away all of the black lines. Uh oh. But we're going to also erase two large plots of, like, erase these turts, too. I'm going to redo my nose because it's, it's not looking good. <laughs> okay. Is this the right? No, this is not the right thickness. I think it was at four. Prox. Is this good? Yeah, this is good. Okay. So we're just going to want to put two, three little things there at the side. There. Now, we're going to just draw some grooves. It doesn't matter how you do this part. As long as you do it. And then two big cat ears. I'm gonna check on how much time I have left to draw this and show you. Oh, five minutes left. Okay, go to the inside. There we go. And now we're just gonna go down here and do some shags for the bottom of the hair now Nia always wears this heart shape heart uh shirt so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna put a little color thing there and uh heart you don't always have to do the heart shirt you can always go to the 
shape thing. Use one of these, or you can use the heart there. Because it's way easier, just pick the fill color, which is always pink for her, but you can choose a different color if you want. And just stick it there. It's that easy. But, oh, okay, I don't want to do that. <laughs> but, or you can use a um, sticker to put there, but we'll do that later. Now our chance is to, oh. okay, we're going to get, change this color to white. Get rid of this part, like some of the hair on this side, so we can fit the arms there. Now for the eyes, let's just draw one little curvedish. Wait, that eye is it? Little curved line, and final touch. And I'm going to show you how to color it in a moment. Okay, guys, so this is how you're supposed to have it color. Wait, where is the tab? Okay. This is how it's supposed to color. As, but I left the hair blank so I can show you how to color it. You're going to pick here. It should be on vector fill, but you don't want vector fill. You want it always on pic pixel fill because I'm going to show you what happens if you do vector fill. The whole thing that's like blank, uh, all the blank areas will turn this color that you're using. So you don't want to use vector fill. You always want to use pixel fill. Now you're going to, there's no brown color. So I'm going to show you how to make your own brown color. And there's like different types of colors you can use, by the way. You don't always have to color as how I color it. You can color it however you want. But... This is just the normal needles because, as you can see, there's um, gradients and stuff, but we don't want that. We need, well, unless you want it, of course, but I'm gonna, wait, they have more colors? Oh, there is a brown, okay. So, you're just going to click on the area you want. Sometimes this will come up, but you don't have to press the check mark every time because if you tap somewhere else, it will go away. Now, I'm going to leave this part up. This part is for last. Always want a heart. White color. Oh, this happens sometimes. I have to reload. It will save. Okay. So I want the heart to be, you want the heart to be white, and she has white heart pupils, so. And if you guys don't know who Mia is, she's one of my characters in uh, one of my comics. Okay, how much time do I have left? Uh-oh. So, for the final... Final touches, we're going to, I'm going to show you, we're going to have a gradient background color. We could use vector, we don't want to use actually, because this part will get messed up. So we're going to be choosing any color, you can use any blank color, any liner, radi, owl, or pattern that you want. But for me, I'm choosing the rainbow uh, liner. Okay, so here it is. Here is your Nia. I don't want that there, actually. Put it here. Here is your Nia. Twenty. Twenty-two. Wait, no, that's... No, no, no. Okay, here it is. You guys enjoyed this. Bye-bye. Mm.